Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and a lot of people are asking the question again because they have the famous Windows 10 update KB503 4441 from January that still doesn't install and still gives them errors. Like I said, hide it. Uh, it's, it's, a, uh, it's not a useful update for 95% plus of the people using Windows. So it doesn't matter if it doesn't install. Uh, just hide it. I've got several videos with the links to download the uh, hide tool from Microsoft. It's not fixed with this update. Actually, Patch Tuesday updates rarely will fix things. They are there to mostly um, just fix security flaws when you go to your Windows updates. So remember that it's just um, security fixes for the most part. There is really no fix uh, at all. The other thing also to remember in that update is that if they do issue a fix at some point, it's a standalone fix. It's not a cumulative update like the other ones. It's really a specific fix for that. It was issued as a separate update, probably for that reason that they knew for some it would install. And so it doesn't uh, cause any issues for the rest of the updates to go through. Uh, and the fix, if it comes eventually, will also be a standalone update that will try to fix whatever. I hope it's done well. If they do issue a fix for that, they have to you know, consider that people not, that don't have a partition, a recovery partition, while well, you just leave them alone and not try to install it or change anything. And you know, just focus on those that might have a recovery partition that's just not big enough. Uh, they could easily do an update that will just resize all of that without any problems. And then again, it's Microsoft, so I know that a lot of people just hearing a update from Microsoft that will play with my partitions sounds like trouble. Uh, you know, it's the way it is. But um, it doesn't matter. And no, it's not fixed with the Patch Tuesday updates today. Uh, like I said, it will be a standalone update. It will be different. Uh, because if it was in a cumulative update, that would have blocked everything else. It's once again showing how Microsoft knew that for some people that update would be uh, a problem. So just hide it. It doesn't matter. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.